Hey, hey. Hi, everyone. Happy Father's Day. Thank you. Yeah, happy <laughs> Father's Day, everybody. You're not going to see this on Father's Day, but it is Father's Day, and we are filming before we leave to go see my dad and to do something that he would like to do. So we're spending it with y'all. <laughs> I hope all of your dads and hubbies and brothers and uncles and sons have a great day today or had a great day today. All right, so as you can see from the thumbnail, we have our stitch fix. Or as I like to call, fish, fish sticks. sticks. <laughs> we have our latest fish sticks to share with you. But first, we're gonna do a little chit chat and fill you in on what to expect in this video. What can I expect? Well, we promised y'all a giveaway because we made it! Yes, we made it! Thank you! One thousand made it over the one thousand mark. Thanks to y'all. Yes, we hit the big one thousand on YouTube and we are just so thankful. Thanks to y'all, we made it two thousand, so we promised you a giveaway. All right, and we promised you a live. I do remember saying that might be scary. Because we've we've never done a live. No, Let's but I will tell y'all. All the editing that has to be done to these videos is because of me. <laughs> so it's a little scary for me to be let loose in the live. <laughs> That's a little scary for you to be let loose in anything. Yeah. Yeah. So, I, li I live my life in fear. <laughs> whatever. So, um, yeah, the live will not be edited it will be unfiltered. And y'all, I don't have a filter, so sometimes I don't realize some of the things I say until I hit the editing portion. And it's like, okay, I can't say that. Anyhow, so a little tidbit of info. So the giveaway. What we're going to do is a little different than usual. Um, usually, you know, there's like a word you say, you like, subscribe, all that jazz. Well, you still are going to have to like and subscribe. I mean, come on. We've got to try to get even more followers, right? That's the whole point yeah, of having yeah, a channel. You want to grow. Yes, I want to grow. We're going to do things different. We're going to have four questions that we're going to ask y'all. Because mm. this is a big giveaway. This is the 1,000. This is a large one. Huge. Big, large, Gigantic. huge. Yeah, I don't know why we do that. We always do that. Gar gargantuan. <laughs> Humongous. Humongous. Okay, yeah. so there's going to be four questions that we have. Colossal. <laughs> Epic. E Epic is a good one. <laughs> we're going to have four, four questions that we're going to ask you throughout this video. So you've clicked on the right video, but you got to watch it. So it's hidden in the video. It's going to be hidden. We're going to drop mm. them through the video. We're going to drop be, little questions. Yeah, we're going to be very mysterious. Oh. I love, I love to be sneaky. Boy, yes, I was sneaky she this likes morning. to be sneaky. She was sneaky this morning. So I heard him trying to be quiet. You know how it is when someone in your household is awake before you and they're really trying to be quiet. And there's just something about that act of trying so hard to be I quiet. I was being quiet. That makes them a little noisy. It's almost no, like you can was... just mentally tell that they're trying to be quiet. <laughs> That's what it was like this morning. So I heard him like, you know, it's almost like ninja stealthy, you know, where he's just doing something and I can't recognize the sound. I was Usually trying to I let her recognize... sleep. I got out of bed and it looked like she was still asleep. I was. Usually, I can recognize the sound of what he's doing. Well, this morning, I was like, I, I can't, I don't know what that is. I don't know what he's doing. He's doing something that I've got to go check out. So, I got up, and I didn't, like, sneak, sneak. Like, I walked normal. No, no I didn't. You snuck it. No, I didn't. I didn't hear a, hear a single footstep. It was real quiet. That's because... Usually, when you walk through the house, it's... And it was no thump, it wasn't no thump this morning. He didn't hear me because what he was doing was noisy. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. Okay, well, anyway. You, you were sneaking this morning. Just admit it. I wasn't exactly sneaking. <laughs> exactly, but you were <laughs> sneaking. 
Okay, so yeah, I, I got him this morning. He was filling the um, laundry, the little pods, washer pods, in this tin can that I keep them in, in the laundry room, and he was filling it up. Trying to help her out, trying to be nice. No, mm -hmm. no. He was doing it because he was trying to make room in his garage, and they're well, stored in his garage. Yeah, and See? <laughs> that too, but I was also trying to help you. I could have just took them and set them in there in the laundry room, but I didn't. <laughs> Anyhow, I'm in there. I'm filling the laundry oh pods gosh. up into the tin, and I turn around, and I see something staring at me. <laughs> I was just standing in the doorway. That's it. I yeah, didn't say, not saying a word. I didn't say boo. <laughs> no, but the hair, she had morning hair. <laughs> I Straight always said morning hair. Bad. Be, you know, bedhead. And I mean, the hair was every which way. I had good dreams. <laughs> you must have. I did. <laughs> but I gotta say, the hair was pretty scary in itself. Because <laughs> it was everywhere. That's every morning. <laughs> and she's sitting there just, just kind of a blank look on her face. I was just waiting for his reaction and to whenever see how he'd react. And then after she saw my reaction, then she's sitting there, just that smirk <laughs> grin, just so proud of herself that she got me. She scared <laughs> me. See? <laughs> and she's still laughing about it. He turned around and he looked at me for a second. So it was like he registered I was standing there and who I was. So it was like he looked at me kind of like this, you know, for a second. But then... A second passed or two seconds passed and then really <laughs> it was like a delayed reaction it was well hilarious. at least i didn't scream like a little girl no that's me <laughs> what how did we get on this i don't know all right so the first this nothing, question <laughs> this has nothing to do with a giveaway does it no the first question okay let's do the first question now before we announce the other part of this. Okay, so the first question is... No. I'm not going to ask the first question. So the second part of this is, we also promised you the live, right? So we've sat down and looked at our schedule, and, you know, instead of weather permitting, we'll say life permitting. Uh, we're going to shoot for July 3rd on Monday night. Monday night, July 3rd for going live. We could do Sunday, July 2nd. That might be better for people. Should we do that? Well, you want a time when people can join us. They're going to be probably getting ready for their festivities. On the 3rd? Maybe. But July 2nd, they're probably going to go out of town. <laughs> we have a dilemma. All right, so we're going to have five questions for this giveaway. You know what happens when you have a dilemma? You have to make a decision. You make Dilemonade. Dilemonade. <laughs> okay, so would you guys... Okay, so this will be the fifth question. Um, we'll start with it. The first question of the giveaway is, do you want to see us go live on Sunday, July 2nd in the early evening? Or Monday, July 3rd in the early evening. Early evening, I'm I'm thinking like 6-ish, 7-ish. Central Standard Time. Central Standard Time, yeah. So let us know Sunday or Monday, you know, 2nd or 3rd. Yeah. So that'll be one of the questions. So you're going to have to write this down. Get you all some notebook powder. Get you all a notebook, notebook powder? <laughs> Where do you get notebook powder at? I know you buy lots of stuff, but where do you buy your notebook powder? <laughs> Timu, that's where everybody's buying everything. Oh. No. Um, okay, so get out a scrap piece of paper or a notepad and a pen because you're going to need to write this down. Forget the notebook powder? Forget the notebook powder. <laughs> this is going to be a good giveaway. You want to be a part of this. I still don't know everything we're doing yet, but we're going to have a good one. I have a feeling I am going to be a part of this. <laughs> You don't have a choice. Okay, so question one. Write it down in your little pad. Question one. The second or the third? Answer that question. Okay, that's the first one they got to answer. Yes. There and will be more to come later in this video. Life permitting, we will go live. Okay. 
I've got to YouTube how to do that <laughs> before that date. But we will go live. And don't let us show up for our first live without anybody. Come come visit. Come see us. We're here because of y'all. You know, come, come see us. Ask us whatever you want. Tell us whatever you want. Just, let's just have some fun chatting. We'd like to learn a little bit about our fans. Yeah. Our family. Our family. Okay, that's friends and family. What's a no. fan and family and friend thing? A fan family. A family. Yeah, a family. You guys yeah. are our family. I just calling that. Thank you very much. That was a good one. Family. Well, I don't know if that was a good one, but friends, fans, and family. You all. <laughs> All right, so let's jump into the Stitch Fix. I'm really excited about the giveaway and the live, and you know, it's around the 4th of July, so yay, it's like independence, it'll be, it'll be fun. It'll be a fun weekend, fun, 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 fun. And if hope you're you guys, on, Hope you guys are having a good summer. Yes, we are not really, we have nothing planned for the summer whatsoever. We're fly by the seat of your pants type. No, we're not. I am a planner and a half. No, but we usually end up flying by the seat of our pants, even though we like to plan. Well, I'm going to start planning, but this summer, I have no idea. It's just a up in the air. crazy, chaotic mess right now. So, um, anyhow, Stitch Fix. I'll have all the details down below, as usual, and to save some time, since we're going to have throw in these questions, um, you know, you guys know the gist of it anyway by now, I'm sure, um... And if you haven't tried it before and want to use one of our links, I'll link that down below as well. And that will give you a free $25 and a free fix, I believe. 25 Free fix and $25 towards your first purchase. So they can get their fix on too. They can get their fix on and get $25 of it for free. Mm -hmm. Yes. And then we would also. And that's a nice way to help support our channel. Yeah. Okay, so let's get into these boxes. And keep your ears on. You be a little careful with that uh, cutter right there, young lady. What are you talking about? You got kind of close to my arm. That's okay. It's a safe cutter. It won't cut you. <laughs> I don't care. It won't cut you. All right. Whoo! Did you see that pop? No, I didn't. I did. It's right here. It popped like confetti. All right. Envelope to send it back. What you don't want. I got, an, I got an envelope too. I have shoes this time. Hey, I think I do too. Maybe we got the same box. <laughs> yeah, right. Maybe they're dressing us alike, you think? Paperwork? Hey, look there. Look the colors I've got. Ooh, you have pretty colors. I do have pretty colors. I got shoes. I got shoes. Hey, I got shoes too. We both have shoes. And here's my bundle. Ooh, that's very colorful. Y'all, I have had my colors done. I'm not going to really get into that because I'm going to do a video later. And I got a packet of info. Yeah. That I have to read. <laughs> because, look, he never wears his glasses. I hate wearing glasses. Yeah, that's very colorful. But Ooh, You are colorful. Yes, but I don't think... That one, hey, that look very Christmassy looking. Christmassy. <laughs> Christmas in July. It's not July yet, but uh, I don't think they're my colors. <laughs> Okay, so let's see. Get your paperwork out. All right. Where am I at? I wonder how many fi fixes I've had now. I don't know. Maybe we need to fix that. But I don't bump. All right. Fish sticks. Well, hello there. I don't have that. Oh, hello is what I have. Well, oh, hello. Hello there. All right. This is my fix number 45. Wow. Ooh, this is an expensive one. Okay. What fix is this? 13. 13. So it tells you how many fix, previous stitch fixes you've had. Because mm -hmm. I usually get two a month. Mine is, my schedule's been off though lately. Mine is way more expensive than Dwayne's, but it doesn't surprise me at all. You know what? We're going to change things up this time. I just feel the need to change things up. We're not going to look at the prices. We're yep. not? We're not going to look at the prices. We're not. We are going to show you these clothes. We're going to try them on. Then we're going to get together, sit back down on the bench, and we are going to 
go over the prices then. I'm going to start with my shoes. Because I think you're skewed when you know the price mm -hmm. beforehand. And I want to just truly love what we like. Truly love what we like. <laughs> I want to truly love what we like. purchase. <laughs> I hate my hair, y'all. I absolutely hate this brassiness hair. It's awful. I got a new haircut for the channel. My barber here did it. <laughs> okay, so we're not going to do that. You know what, though? I will read our um, notes. I'll read our notes. All right, you read our notes. Okay, I'll read our notes, but we're not going to look at the prices anymore until the end. Happy Fix Day, Sherry. I'm so excited to have this opportunity to style you again, and I hope that this fix brightens your day. I am happy that you had the opportunity to review your fix preview and selected five items to be set your way. Apparently, I chose five. What specifically made you drawn to these items? Was it the color, the print, the silhouette, etc.? Of course, this is before I got my color done. Be sure to share this feedback after trying the pieces so I can continue to learn your style and preferences over time. Are there any areas of your closet that you would like to focus on next? Yes, I'm going to create a whole new closet. Maybe you need to explain you've got your colors done because nobody no. understands. No, they will. Oh. I'm going to explain later. Um, are there any areas of your closet that you would like to focus on next? I already said that. Yes, I'm going to redo my whole closet. Is there anything that you would love to see in your next VIX preview? I look forward to your feedback and hope you have a great day. Cheers, Laura. All right. You want to read it or you want me to? Yours is always smaller. Than You'll mine. have to read it. I can't read it. I, I'm... You have the tiniest writing. Welcome back, Dwayne. How are you and Sherry? We're Okay. <laughs> busy busy very I, busy i cannot believe it's already june 2023 is flying by yes yes it is bailey mm -hmm. oh i didn't even look to see if you had bailey yes you yes had bailey. bailey okay i'm so like glad bailey. you were able to check out your fixed preview and look at the fun pieces you have selected that was me <laughs> he didn't select this time sherry did i, I was a little were... busy to select it this time so i like sherry i gave her busy. i gave her the reins on this he gives me the reins on everything. That's why I'm busy. Um, I know you were looking for a colorful summer colored top. That would be Sherry speaking. So I was excited to see you snag some fun tops. That's because I picked them. Try on the Flag and Anthem Vintage Wash button down with the Flag and Anthem shorts and finish the look with the Sperry Boat Shoes. Oh, be still my... Can I show them? Be still my junior high heart. Sure. I opened it. I, I opened them. them up. I want them. In the worst way. I want a pair of those. <laughs> These are bands. Uh-huh. Yeah, happy Father's Day. Thanks. Um, they, do look, they do look pretty nice. Because they're quality shoes. And that's why we're not going to look at the price. Because if he looked at the price and then he tried it on, he wouldn't buy them. Because, oh, they're too expensive. No, we're going to start looking at quality instead of quantity. We have quantity and it's not the best, you know? So, okay. Moving on. Uh, finish this look with the Sperry Boat Shoes for date night with Sherry. I know you are looking for dressy. She told you to have a date night with Sherry, by the way. So you better start listening. I know you are looking for dressy brown leather tennis shoes. That well, would be because Sherry. Well, I got, I got to save some money. I got to buy cheap clothes so I can afford the date night for Sherry. No, Sherry doesn't. No, there is no date nights and there is no nice clothes. <laughs> How do you like this boat shoe style? Yes, I love it very much, Bailey. If you have any upcoming trips, events, or special requests, I can look for next time. Share this information at checkout as well. Thanks so much. Enjoy your new items, and we'll see you next time. Take care. Cheers, Bailey. I love her. She is awesome. Yes. Okay, so question number one. For the give No, question number two. Two. We already did number one. Question number two for the giveaway. <laughs> what is your favorite... What is your favorite way to spend the 4th of July? What do you enjoy doing the most? What is your favorite way to spend the 4th of July? And these answers can be long and lengthy. That's absolutely fine. What's, what's your favorite way? I stumped her. I like to go see the fireworks. Huh. I could go somewhere and just watch the fireworks and eating some kind of yummy 4th of July food, you know? I don't know. No. What's yours? Mine? Probably be have a uh, family get together where we grill or barbecue something and um, 
actually probably like at the river or something. I think it would be no fireworks. Awesome. We do fireworks at the river. Yes. Oh. On a gravel bar or something. Huh. Okay. Yeah. And then we have a um, local carnival that's every year, and I used to do that a lot when I was young. And they have a huge fireworks spectacular, which, you know, I actually enjoy going to the carnival and um, playing some of those games and walking around. And I used to be all about all the rides. And, I mean, I would ride all night long. But now, as I've gotten older, I just have this, um, this, uh, what's that called? Intolerant, not intolerance. Um, uh, aversion. I have this aversion as I've gotten older to riding rides that come off of a truck for words, some reason. In other words, kind of a little bit of a fear. <laughs> I just don't think it's the smartest thing to do. Really? Well, some of the operators sometimes that operate these rides are a little... Uh, sometimes. A little sketchy looking. <laughs> but I do enjoy all the carnival games and um, walking around and seeing people, you know, we haven't seen for a while and mm -hmm. and the carnival foods and the fireworks and all that. I like the atmosphere. Yeah, I like that. That atmosphere is kind of my jam. I okay, think. so what do y'all like to do the most to celebrate the 4th of July? All right. Now, you already seen our bundles, right? Mm -hmm. All right, let's get in here. So we're just going to read the tags. We're, we're going to dig gonna... in. Yeah, we're going to dig in. Nick and Zoe. Ooh, I or like Zoe. That. Sure. Nick and Zoe. You're welcome. I picked Thank everything. You. you did good. <laughs> this, that. You, between <gasps> you, you and Bailey make a good team. Next Stitch Fix. I'm going to let you see my Stitch Fix preview and choose, and I will do, I'll choose yours, and then we'll see oh, how good they are. Oh, we're going to choose each other's, but you already did mine. Yeah, but I'm going to do it again. That, 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 that's a good idea. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Don't you oh, think that's a good this idea? This will either be a hit or a miss for sure. Okay. Nick and Zoe. Zoe. Nick and Zoe. I think it's Zoe. I don't know. Some either people one say Zoe. Um, it is a sleeveless. Let me read the, it doesn't have a price on here, so let me read. Nick and Zoe Geo Pain Knit Tank Red Extra Extra Large. So, I will say that it's fun. I picked it because I thought it was super fun. I didn't know it was going to be so, like, um, I didn't know that the red was actually going to be so, uh, what is that word? Christmassy? No. <laughs> uh, Vivid? Vivid is a good word. That's not the word, but vivid, yes. Right. I didn't know it was going to be as saturated, that the red was going to be as saturated as this. And I thought you would see more pink, because there's pink in there, believe it or not. So red, pink, and black. But um, that's before I had these colors done that you'll learn about. And yeah, red is not a good color for me. So, But I'm definitely going to try it on. I thought it was super fun, like I said. And it feels really nice and quality. And yeah, I'm excited to try it on. Mm -hmm. I wish it came in other colors. But oh, I was going to tell you how much it is. But I can't because I don't know. Uh, oh, their tag says take care and enjoy. Now that's quality. 95% viscose and 5% spandex. All right. You're up. I'm Buttercup. A, this is the shirt. I really like this shirt. I like the colors in it. Flag and anthem. I get, I bet you, since I it's picked it out, all of it. sleeve. I bet he has maybe close to a five out of five. I, I like it. <laughs> you know me pretty well, too, though. Yeah. He's a faded, rugged right. man. <laughs> it's a flag and anthem. Um, feels like cotton. It says it right here. Okay. You have to read your little tag. Uh, well, oh, you don't have a see, readable tag. See, it doesn't say it right there. Well, that's... Oh, here it is. Yeah. Oh, it does have a little tag. Yeah. It was hid. Jamestown. Short sleeve vintage wash shirt. Red. Size large. Size large. I like. You like? Mm -hmm. You did good. Thanks. And it's soft. I think Bailey, you and I, I think we could uh, we could create him a pretty nice quality yeah. wardrobe. I think we just, you and Bailey might be able to dress me. I think we just need to kick, kick him out of the uh, equation and we'll just redo his wardrobe because he needs it. Uh, poly cotton blend. 
poly cotton mm -hmm. one. And it's got an extra button sewn right there on the tag. He is so excited about those little extra buttons. How many times have you ever lost buttons? Men's shirts, I'm gonna say, they we tend to take a lose buttons pretty often. Okay. Next up for me is Daniel Rain. Imagine that. Um, it is really a fun, colorful top. I chose it because it was very, very uh, Christmassy. Colorful. <laughs> Christmassy. Colorful. I like color. Okay, so um, I do like it a lot. It is the Daniel Rain Amari Split Neck Blouse Green Extra Extra Large. I do think it's super cute with this um, pleating and the split v-neck. I like that. I think that's very um, flattering. It's kind of hard to see, but yeah, split vet, split vet, split, split v-neck neck here. And then, yeah, the, the pleating. It's really soft to the touch. I think it's going to be really a cute shirt, but again, <laughs> it's not my colors. Spoiler alert! And it's 100% rayon. So, yeah. What's next? All right. Stop! What is it? Question time. Question number three. Question time. What's your favorite foods? What's your favorite food or foods um, to eat on the 4th of July? Ooh. What's yours? Mine? Yeah. That's easy. Hot dogs? No. <laughs> no. No hot dogs. Watermelon. Barbe oh, barbecue. Barbecue. Yeah. Corn on the cob. Yeah. Watermelon. Yeah. Got to have at least those three. And you, if you want to throw in some cantaloupe and some baked beans or tater salad. No, I like that. You don't like that. <laughs> so I love it, I do. If you want to throw any of that in, I'm going to say that's just icing on the cake. Cake, too. That's fine. <laughs> Strawberry shortcake. Mm. Really? Yeah, yeah, with lots of whipped cream. <laughs> I know I lost her at whipped cream. What's yours? Okay. I would also agree with barbecue or homemade Dwayne grilled burgers. Oh, yeah, grilled burger, burgers are good. Dwayne's grilled burgers are good. He seasons them perfectly for me. I like my meat very seasoned and it is, they're just, they're perfection. They're perfection. Really? Yes. So um, I would agree. One of those. I love corn on the cob. We can put that on the menu. No problem with that whatsoever. Watermelon, of course. He forgot something that I guarantee you he would beg for. Homemade ice cream. To have on the menu, and that is deviled eggs. Oh, yes. Deviled <laughs> eggs and homemade ice cream. Homemade ice cream sounds amazing. Yes. I think I would rather have that for dessert um, than anything else, honestly, on the 4th of July. Homemade ice cream. That would mm -hmm. be perfection. Um, yeah, definitely watermelon, uh, deviled eggs, corn on the cob. Meat, either one of those, and of course macaroni and cheese. I mean, come on, Mac and <laughs> it's cheese America. We have to have <laughs> macaroni and cheese. So that would be my my perfect meal. That's perfect. Tell me what you guys. I wonder what, I wonder what everybody else likes. If yeah, I know. I wonder if we're in line with what everybody else likes. Exactly. Okay. All right. Now. You like I that have, one? Yeah, flag and anthem. I like this. Oh, I'm done reading. I can take off my glasses. I like. I like that. I like, I like the, the color. color. I like the texture. I like mm -hmm. the softness. Yep. That's nice. And it's a space dye. And yeah, space it's dye. more of the uh, summery type color, I feel. All right. And what does it say? It's the what? No, come on. I don't hear it saying the thing. This is going to be an hour long video. Flag and Anthem Norris Snow Slub Henley. Orange, size large. Okay. And it's probably cotton. Probably. I don't know. 52 cotton, 48 poly. Cotton oh, poly. so it won't shrink. Or and look at there. It comes with a button on the tag. Him and his buttons. You know what I would like a button for? What? No, that don't way. you say it. <laughs> and guess what? Guess I know. what? They go together. <laughs> Did you and Bailey plan it that way? This was all Sherry. Oh. Bailey didn't? No, what happened was they sent him a fixed preview, okay? 
And I know that the very first fix preview in Stitch Fix, if you did not know this, comes from me, from, well, not from me. It comes, comes from, from you? No. When did you go to work for Stitch Fix? <laughs> hey, Stitch, Stitch Fix. Sticks. I can style somebody, look at here. Okay, so um, it comes from the algorithm of like based on things that you've liked in the past. But if you don't like anything that they send you and they send you 10 options and you get five, right? Mm -hmm. So they send you um, 10 options and I declined all of them for him. I didn't like any of them. They were, it wasn't that I didn't like them per se, but they weren't, I feel. Flattering? Uh, very good for summer. They were more like, Dwayne would seriously look like fall. You were looking for all better, year long. better options. <laughs> I was looking for a little more colorful options. Oh. So I put that in the um, little description. And then the second fix, they asked if I wanted a second fix preview. And I said, yes, for him. I was pretending to be him. And um, then your stylist comes in and sends you 10 options. Oh. So these were all, there was 10 things picked by Bailey. So I'm not going to say she didn't have anything to do with it because she did. But um, I chose, I found actually five that I liked, I believe. Wasn't it all five that I picked? I don't know. I think it might have been. Yeah, I think it was. So, all right. All Next. right, you're, oh, you're it's up. Not, I'm, I'm you're up. You're up. Okay. Z Better Supply. Up. Better up. Z Supply. Um, Ooh, I do I like, like Z Supply, and this is very soft. And y'all. I like that. This could be my colors. It is kind of a nautical preppy type look to me, I feel like. That could go with so many things. And that's soft. It's very soft. I like the fact that um, something like this is more like, I feel like a basic. Because you can slap this on with something hot, bright pop of color on the bottom. And it'd be fun. You know, like, like a neutral would be. Um, you know, I could put hot coral or red or hot pink or, you know, some kind of a bright summer color in shorts or ankle pants. I'm not going to say capris because if you don't know, capris are out. Why? They're out of style. Oh. They make you look supposedly older and frumpier. So, um, but, or you can also wear this like in the um, fall with a pair of jeans or um, put a... Uh, cardigan sweater in the winter over it or even a blazer so there's so much you so can you do can with wear this. that year round you can wear this year round and i like the fact that it has the v-neck and as long as it's not too low because i don't like to show the girls but i do like v-necks because they are a nice necklace enhancer i feel like and and you don't feel like you know how how is that again you, know, <laughs> you can show off your little necklace i or, hate feeling like <laughs> Or get some sun. <laughs> if it's in the summertime, you can get a little sun there as long as you have your sunscreen on. So I'm excited about this one. Uh, what I know it's Z Supply, but what is the Tamika? This is the Tamika V neck knit top blue extra extra large. So I like it. Oh, what's the um, fabrication? Yeah, what is it? I bet it's got cotton in it. 60 cotton, 40 poly. I'm up. A1 Algo. Those are the shirts made from water bottles that Scott this likes. This is a water bottle shirt. Mm -hmm. It's soft. It is. For a water bottle. I've never, I've never had a water bottle feel this soft. And I love that color to go with your eyeballs. <laughs> All right. It is. Oh, what now go? Durant or Durant? Durant Performance, Performance tea. Teal green, size large. Yeah. And it is. Made with recycled water bottles. A UPF 40, what's that? Resist That's bacterial order, odors, orders. UPF 40 is a, is a sunblock. It's quick, dry, and moisture wicking. Mm -hmm. And I think it would look beautiful on you. So it would make me look beautiful? It would enhance your beautifulness. Oh. Thank you. Well, it is Father's Day after all. So you got to be nice to me, don't you? <laughs> Supposed to be. Supposed to be. 94 poly and 6% spandex. Mm -hmm. So it is stretchy. Yep. I love that color. Yeah. You're okay. up. Next is something that I don't think will match any of these shirts. That's not. But 
blue denim color. That's they're unusual and different and unique. And I there you are. Don't know. I'm kind of thinking I might like them. I'm not sure. But they're cut from the cloth and they're very unusual. Oh, shorts. Okay. Uh I wouldn't I don't know what you call this. It's almost like a tie-dye faded kind of, like it's almost a purple look. It's a purple blue, but it's really blue. It's unique. It's, but it's purpley blue. It's not bad though. No, and it's like a it's like a stretchy knit. It's I like the back flat pockets. And the back and the front kind of um, pork chop pockets. Pork chop pockets. And look at all that give. I mean, it's just I kind of like them. I think. Kind of. Cut from the cloth, Margot Utility Bermuda short. Now I wouldn't call that a Bermuda. That is not a Bermuda length, y'all. That's maybe five inches, right? Isn't that about five inches? Mm. Yeah, Inseam. I would say close. Um, it's a size 20W. That might be a little big, thankfully. Um, and it says the color is blue. And it is a purple blue, I will say. It is it's a very kind of a pretty color. color. This with a white t-shirt would be absolutely just a... Just a... <laughs> just a what? A great... Just, <laughs> oh, just a what? This say, would, say it again, it'd be just, just a... This would be, with a white t-shirt and these shorts, it would be like the perfect summer outfit. Okay. Yeah. I like that. You're up, Buttercup. I'm up. All right, what do I have here? I have Flag and Anthem. Shorts. Cargo. Cargo. His favorite. My favorite. I do like cargo shorts. Button pockets on the back. On my back. Button pockets on my back. I like button pockets on my back. That way my wallet doesn't come out whenever I sit down. Otherwise, sometimes your wallet is slick and it'll slide out. That's not on your back. On my butt. Back side. On my butt. <laughs> this is your back. On my behind. <laughs> and extra it comes buttons. with extra buttons. <laughs> Okay, should we call him Scooby still, or should we call him Buttons? Now he's, like, talking all about the buttons. I still like my snacks. Mm -hmm. And he likes his buttons. I'm going to start calling him Buttons. This button. is a motion stretch that offers comfort, retention, and durability for your versatile lifestyle. My lifestyle is pretty versatile. No, it isn't. It needs to be. It is stretchy. It's the Hayden 10-inch cargo short navy, size 32. And 10 inch inseam. He doesn't like those super long, like basketball style inseam. No, that's like I don't like really long. To your knees or below. Okay. Because no, you you oh, said why that am I taking this? you said capris are out. That's like that that's reminds me of that reminds me of capris, the ones that come way down below your knees. Yeah. For men, no, that <laughs> looks like men's capris. <laughs> Just not for me. <laughs> capris are out, but I've seen a lot of pedal pushers lately, though. Which what is, are pedal what pushers? I find very interesting. You don't know what pedal pushers are? Bike riders. Huh? Bicycle riders. No. That's they what I call knees. a pedal pusher because they're pedaling. They're pushing down on that pedal as they're going down the road. Well, maybe that's where the name came from. That's what because I call. Because they go to your like they go to your <clears throat> knees and they they yeah maybe that is where they came well, from. But I, they were popular in the in the sixties. Well, that's what I call a pedal pusher. Somebody riding a bicycle pushing down on the pedal trying to get it to go. Um. Okay. So. Let's do question number four. Ooh. Question number four. No, let's wait. Let's do All it. right. Oh, these are something. Ooh. Wow. Oh, my, my. And wow. I, I haven't seen that name brand in a long time. I, I didn't even know they made those still. <laughs> I used to wear these religiously. In my early 20s. Keds. Keds. Look how fun. I didn't know they still made Keds. Aren't those fun for summer? Oh my gosh. Cute. I gotta check these out. Those are cute. They were really soft insoles. Oh, Keds have really good arch support. Those That's why I use, but look, they're like a platform sneaker. They'll make me a, like an inch taller. You need that, Jordan. <laughs> you need that. 
Them are kind of neat. I like these. Those are pretty. Them are really kind of Yeah. Pretty. Well, those are fun. Yeah. Okay. All right. I think you'll like those. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't say... Um. Oh, yes, it does. Hold on. The... Oh, I thought it said icky kicky. The triple <laughs> kick tropical embroidery sneaker. Sneakers. Sneakers. <laughs> we got sneak new sneakers. I can't talk ever, y'all. This is why we have such a weird language between that's, us. Because once I mispronounce a word, that's just it. being like talking fast, then it sticks. So that, we still say warder just because one that's of the exactly said what she did to me this morning when I turned around and what Whenever I was refilling her uh, detergent pods, she sneakled up on me. Sneakled up on me. <laughs> Size seven was and a half. You wearing your sneakers, was you? <laughs> no, <laughs> I was just in my jammers. <laughs> okay, that's it. I think All the right. fix for me, honestly, I think it's it's a good one. I really do. I think this is a good fix. I don't think I'm gonna get all of them because since. Since I've picked these items, um, now I know a little bit more about color and I'm learning about that. So, uh, but I am really happy with this fix overall. And your leg hair is like Sorry. really itching the crap out of my leg. And them sneaklers are really bright and colorful themselves. Yeah, I like them. <laughs> What's your shoes? Oh, we already saw your shoes. My Sperry shoes. shoes. Are these actually Sperry's? Yes, Sperry. They got a... Yes. They're the real deal. The real deal. Pickle. Boat shoes. They do say Sperry's on the bottom. Though. I know my Sperry's. Oh. <laughs> I don't have a boat. Yes, you do. We just got a boat yesterday. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm a little scared, but yeah. Okay. A little, little boat. <laughs> All right. But it's ours. <laughs> I'm curious about these... Uh, they spares. They're not sneakers, though. You're actually going to be, like, trending. Am I going to be in style? You know what? Between you, me and Bailey, we might be able to make you into a trending, like, a influencer, um, trending, hot husband I style. Doubt, I doubt it, but you might. I'm, I thought I was already there. Yeah, but the clothes <laughs> will match, see? Oh, you got, you don't have, your clothes don't match your swag, darling. Oh, wow. I'll be simply irresistible then, won't I? <laughs> <laughs> Will you find me simply irresistible then? I already do. That's why <laughs> we're together, right? Yep. You bet. Betcha. Okay, so question? drop it. Drop it like it's hot. Is there a question? Question number four. Question number four. I've said the first three. You can drop the last two. What was the two. fourth one? <laughs> I knew he was going to say that, y'all. Um, what's your favorite thing to do? No, we already did that. Oh. Check. Food. We went through the food. Check, check. Favorite. He has no memory Okay. Ever. What you... Yes, I do. Yes, I do. You just gave me a hint. What's your favorite Fourth of July memory that you've ever that yeah. you've ever experienced? Yeah. Oh, your favorite Fourth of July that you've ever had in your life. What were you doing? Who were you with? What I mean, tell us about it. Oh, I've had two that I could that stands out to me. I didn't know we were going to answer these questions. I, I'm not prepared. I know, but I'm sure that they want to know our answers too. Okay. It's only fair. All right. What's, What's your yours? favorite? For, no, you start it. I have the young me, the young Dwayne as a kid. My favorite memory is being at the river with my family, 4th of July. We would take the boat up and down the river. I'm going to say we would have a big barbecue, cook out, camp out overnight on the riverbank, go fishing, just, you know, grandpa and grandma and, and you know, aunts and uncles would be there and mom and dad and just. That, that was my favorite as a kid, doing stuff like that. I remember we had the sodas, the cool, uh, coolers full of sodas. And... <laughs> that was like the only time of year, right? Didn't you tell me that? Yeah, that we Fourth of July was the only time you got soda. We didn't get soda very often. Y'all had soda every that day was in about, my house. That was about the only time we really got soda. Okay, so and that's my, cool. And my older version, mm -hmm. my favorite, um, we went to Vegas one time. 
He's stealing the, my During answer. the 4th of July. Well, it can be both of ours. Yeah. But we were laying in the uh, bed there in the uh, motel. And it was a big casino motel. I don't know if we can say the name of it or not. but Probably. Anyhow, it was one of MGM. the... MGM. Yeah. Not MGM. Well, it was one of the major... Mara Mara Gosh, I'm <laughs> I, the struggle is so real. Anyhow, anyhow, we were laying there in bed, and we weren't expecting this. We, just, we had to go, you know, get on the plane the next day to come back home. Yeah, it was the actual 4th, and we didn't get to go into the Las Vegas festivities because no. we had a, like... Early flight. Early really flight. Really early flight. Yeah. So we're laying there. We have the... Try and go sleep. We have the curtains open, you know, just so we can, you know, see the lights of Vegas. Then all of a sudden we hear boom, boom, boom. And look out, and we have the most awesome fireworks display just right out in front of our window. While we're laying in bed. While we're laying in bed. So we got to lay in bed that night and watch the fireworks, and they were some pretty impressive fireworks. Well, it doesn't hurt when you're snuggled up, you know, all comfy in bed together and watching the fireworks. It was kind of, it was very romantic. So you, that was yours too then, huh? Mm -hmm. How about a young version? Do you have a young version? When we were kids, like my dad, he always had to get the snakes. And I thought, I mean, I was always scared because, you know, the, the word snake, there wasn't nothing I wasn't afraid of as a kid, let me tell you. And um, they were really neat to watch. But Sean and I, my brother and I, we used to like those um, poppers that you would just throw on the ground and they pop. So I enjoyed, you know, going and getting those little things. And, and it was year after year of snakes and fountains and poppers and sparklers. Now that is where I will say my very funniest Fourth of July ever when I was a kid was the very first time my parents bought or my papa one of the two of them bought um sparklers for us it was our first year with sparklers we never had those before my brother is younger than me um and he was never like the scaredy cat like I was <laughs> so he's all about it and I am deathly scared afraid of these sparklers I mean so scared of these sparklers. I was petrified. I did not want to hold it. Everybody around me is holding it. I didn't understand how come they could hold these things, you know, because I just knew it was going to kill me because that's fire. You know, that's going to, that's going to hit. It's going everywhere. Well, yeah, it took probably a box of, of uh, sparklers to finally get me to hold a sparkler. And so, then you probably wouldn't. Then I was sad they up. were all gone. <laughs> out um but one thing one fourth of july that i remember um when shelby was growing up uh her and i were alone and i decided we're gonna go see the fireworks and this was way past bedtime you know but it was a weekend and i said i told her i said uh get your shoes on and we had our jammies on get your shoes on and she's like why? I said, we're going to go somewhere. So we went in our pajamas, both of us, across the street in this um, shopping center parking lot, across the street from that big park that I said puts on that annual carnival every year where they do the fireworks spectacular, spectacle, spect spectacular, spectacle, spectacle. <laughs> there we go. There I got it. Um, and so we showed up and there wasn't hardly anybody over there. This is before everybody figured out that you could go there. And now you can't get a parking spot. So we hauled up together in our pajamas, got those poppable, you know, um, what are those chairs that you just open up those pop-up chairs, got two of those sat down and we watched the fireworks with some, uh, snacks and just in our pajamas. And I will never forget that. It was one of, you know. One of those moments that mama, mama and daughter just, you know, probably will never forget. So. Just a nice shared moment. It was. It was. And my favorite adult was the one he was, he was talking about. He already told you. <laughs> so what's yours? Yeah. I would be curious to find out some other people's experiences. Yeah. Okay. So that's it for the unboxing portion. And you get to see her sneakers or what is it? <laughs> Good to see you trying your sneaklers. You already saw my sneaklers this morning. <laughs> All right, and stay tuned for question number 
Bye. Ooh, there's one final There's question. one final question. One final question. And you have to answer all five. Like. And like and subscribe. And then I think we're going to choose the answer. Answer. The winner? I think we're going to choose the winner on our live. Right, oh. right then. When we're sitting wow. in front of you. We're going to choose it. Yeah. Isn't that cool? That's, That's cool. cool. We'll be back. Here we go. It's the next day, y'all. Like I said, <laughs> we have outfit number one. Actually, Dwayne has four items on right now, and I have three. So. All right. I'll go ahead and go first. I love this shirt. I really like the the look of this shirt. The fadedness of the it. The fadedness. I'm going to say, I just, I love it. It's lightweight, mm -hmm. feels good, comfortable, and I love the shirt underneath it. And it yeah. matches. Yeah. I finally will have some clothes that match. <laughs> I need to put little tags on for him. Yep. Yeah. Little tag. Yeah, you need to mark them so that I yeah. know they match. Yeah. Trouble is, I get my clothes in the uh, closet. I'll hang them up separately, and then I forget they ever go together again. Well, we need to reorganize your closet and then kind of pair things together for you. But we have to pull out a lot of old that you have in there, mm -hmm. so you have room to see what you have. Yes. Yeah. But what do you think? I like it. It looks what, like you. What do you all think? I, say, I love it myself. I gotta say this. This is my style. <laughs> and then your short. There you go. It's got the pockets in, like I say, the they're snap flap pockets. I'll say they they are comfortable. Got a little stretch to them. Got buttons. <laughs> and I've got the Sperry shoes. Don't make fun of my white legs. <laughs> I haven't got any sun really on them this year. But these the the shoes I like them. They are leather shoes. But I, I really take a wide width, and these are really too too narrow for me. So these the shoes will be going back for sure. Those are nice, though. I like. They those. are nice shoes. They are good quality shoes. Sperry shoes. Sperry. Yes. Okay, I have the Z Supply striped T-shirt on. Um, V-neck. It's super soft. It it fits pretty good. It's just very, I mean, there's a lot of stretch here. It's just a little bit snug, but it won't be snug for that much longer. You are soft. <laughs> I like soft. I like the top. I like the, I like the coloring of the top and everything. I just think that the V-neck might be a little too plunging for me. I, I don't, I don't feel very comfortable in it. It could doesn't you, really show anything. Could but you wear something underneath it? To... I don't want to do that. Not with hot flashes. Mm-mm. No, I don't like to layer right now. <laughs> it's too hot. I'm layered. This is kind of warm. Yeah. But I, I just thought the two of these go nice together. But Yeah. Now, I will tell you, I basically look like a patchwork quilt because nothing I have on matches. <laughs> so just use your imagination. All right. And then I'll show you the shorts. Okay. Whoa. So I have these cut from the cloth, like knit shorts. You can see they're too big, which that's a good thing. Um, I think they're very comfortable. I really like them for just lounging around, but y'all, these are not <laughs> Bermuda length. I mean, they're, they're just, they're really too short, I feel like, for my uh, comfort level. But I would have to size down if I decided to keep them. I just, I think the color is really unique, but what other than a white t-shirt really would I have to go with it? <laughs> I don't know. Um, so I can look and see if they have a size down if I choose to keep them, but I don't really think they're that flattering. And even though they're comfortable, I don't think it's something that I need in my closet. And then the shoes. The sneaklers. The sneaklers. Aren't these fun, y'all? I mean, look at all those pretty summer colors. And they're so comfortable. They fit like a glove. I don't know. I'm tempted on these. I'll have to see how much they are. And if I can find them cheaper somewhere else. I just think they're adorable. Those were kids? Kids. Yep. And if you notice, I'll do a close-up right here. Both of the toes have a little different design, so it would match so many different tops for summer. So that's it for three of my pieces and four of his. Let us know what you think of his. And I'm really 
really eager to see his next top with his eye color. So we'll see. I have two more tops. All right, we'll be back with our next pieces. My next piece. We did not forget, y'all. Last question. Do you remember what it is? I've slept last <laughs> night. I guess I do good to remember. I, I do good to remember my name anymore, it seems like. All right. The last question is, what is your favorite part of our channel? What's the favorite? Um, what are the what are the videos that you always gravitate to push play on? We would like to know. So is it Stitch Fix? Is it clothing in general? Is it favorites? Are you a reader? Um, is there something that you would like us to bring to the channel? Let us know down below. I'm curious. Okay. And so that what's is your all favorite five. part of the channel? <laughs> it doesn't count. Well, yeah, like I say, we've been answering all these questions. This is the only one we haven't answered. I don't know. I, my favorite part of having the channel is meeting all the people. My favorite part is making these videos for everybody and hearing the nice comments. Yeah, I like to read I, the I, nice I, comments. <laughs> I, everybody is, for the most part, yeah. are very nice. And yeah. like you'll have a few that maybe they're having a bad day or something. I don't know. But... I just ignore them. So, y'all, oh my gosh. I wish this was my color. I really do. This fits me like a glove, and it's soft, and it's so comfortable. I think it looks nice on you. Oh, I just absolutely, I mean, it just, it's not too low. It just looks, it just fits so well, so well. So this is what it looks like in the back. If you notice, it has some hot pink, red, and black, which, and white, obviously, which um, none of those are supposed to be by color. So I'm, I'm a sad panda because I really, really, really liked it. And I don't like to really wear a lot of sleeveless, but um, I don't know. I just, I just thought it fit really nicely. So yeah, I'm sad to have to send this one back. You know, you, you got a little bit of the farmer's tan going on there on your arms. You see that? Yeah, that's my <laughs> life. All right. All right. I like that shirt. I, I like, like this shirt. I like it too. Water like I say, it's shirt. pretty soft for wearing a water bottle. Water bottles in it. Like I say, I do like this the color of this shirt. I like the softness for wearing a water bottle. A shirt made of water bottles. This is soft. And it's moisture wicking. So moisture wicking for hiking and mm -hmm. you know stuff like that. It's, it isn't hot. I thought it might be hot being You're really made soft. from plastic water bottles. I know. He's soft. <laughs> It looks good with your eyes. Thanks. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, I like it too. It seems to fit pretty well. I like I like this shirt. You may have to keep the shoes. The shoes has got to go. They're too tight. They're too narrow. The wider width, yes. This width, they're too they're too tight. I wonder if they have wide width, because you would get twenty five percent off. I don't know. But Maybe I really like all the other stuff. See. Yeah. Okay, he is finished. I am not. I have one more top. Wow, I see you're wearing your Christmas colors today. It's not Christmas colors. Lime green is not Christmas the colors. Red, the red shirt you just had on. Oh. I gotta say, and now you're going to the red and green are Christmas colors. What am I gonna do with him? He was very Christmassy. Okay, so it's comfortable. Um, it fits fairly well. I think it's nice for summer. It's not my colors again. You gotta put your, you gotta hang in straps, hang it out. They can't see that though. If you turn around, they can see it. Um, you know, I think it is very comfortable. I, I have to keep her straightened out. She keeps me straightened out. I don't think it's all that flattering, but I think it's pretty. So, I mean, if you're looking for something similar to this, I would say that it is, you know, a decent quality and it's cool and comfy and I like the way that it, that it actually fits. But to be honest, out of everything in my box, I'm really in love with the shoes. I'm very tempted with the shoes, but I don't know. I'll have to think on it. 
You guys tell me what you think about this the, stuff. The sneaklers? The sneaklers. The, the kids' sneaklers? Yes. They're very comfy. I still have them on. Um, they are colorful. Nice. They're really colorful for summer, spring and summer. So I don't know. We'll 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 see. And with they Dwayne's look, box. They just look like fun shoes. Yeah, they're fun and comfortable. That's at my age I want comfort. <laughs> and me, I gotta say I like the first shirt that I showed you all and the, the one I had underneath it. I like that combination of those two. This shirt, I, I like this shirt also. I do too. The shoes will go. Will have to go back because they're too narrow. The shorts, I'm on the fence about, but the three shirts, I like the shorts. It's going to be hard to give up the shirts. The shorts are I, a really nice uh, quality. I feel. I'm thinking about keeping the at least the first two shirts. I have several shirts like this. This, but I like this shirt. So. But you don't. Have, I don't think you have this color. I'm not sure I have this color either. Yeah. I like this shirt. So. I do too. I do too. I'm struggling with this one. Well, I know of a lot of shirts he has in his closet that could really truly be rotated out. So, truthfully. <laughs> but it looks nice. And they look nice with these um, with these blue cargo. Oh, you can't see. But yeah, I think it looks nice. I do. My, my guess is, the way it sounds, I'm keeping this shirt and I'm going to take and get rid of some shirts in my closet. <laughs> way it sounds question if they have a wide width would you consider the shoes yes okay yes i was just curious they're just a narrow width right now they're a good quality shoe mm -hmm. and good good heavy leather yeah and it's just too narrow on my feet like i guess mm -hmm. I, I can't wear them without you know very long at a time without them hurting my feet but they do make leather stretchers right yeah but you need to get the right width to begin with but isn't a leather stretcher to give you the right width not necessarily. The this, this sole itself, I'm going to say the leather's going to hang out oh, on the sides. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Okay. So, so I, just, I just need a wire width. Let's so. go over prices. I have them over this, here. This is the hard part. This, this is the scary part. We'll start with me. So the cut from the cloth, what they call the Bermuda shorts in that funky blue color, um, they're $79. The Keds uh, Tropical Embroidery Sneakers, they're 95. The Daniel Rain, this top, the Daniel Rain's uh, Mari Split Neck Blouse Green is $64. The Z Supply V-neck Knit Top, the blue and white stripe one, um, is 36. So it's a really, it's an affordable price, but I'm just a little concerned about the, the plunging V-neck. And the Nick and Zoe Geo Pain Knit Tank that I love the way it fit. Oh my gosh. I'm glad it's not my color. $138. Ooh. <laughs> so if I bought all five pieces out of my box, the subtotal is $412. With a buy all discount, 25% off would be $103 off. It would take it down to $309. So for a $412 box, um, the $103 really does help, but there's, there's no way I'm going to keep all five. So, um, if anything, I might consider the shoes, but I'll kind of search and see if I couldn't find them cheaper. And I hear that Stitch Fix will match prices. That's what I've heard. Mm. So I'm going to try it. See? Mm. All right. Now you're let's... Gonna, you're going to make them get on, get their game, <laughs> game on, huh? Possibly. With the game face? Okay. Dwayne's cargo shorts, the navy, 10, 10 inch um, inseam, which is perfect fit for him, $49.50. And that's not bad because it's a nice quality. And mm -hmm. when you go to Kohl's or JCPenney's, they're that price. So the Sperry's original leather boat shoe in tan. Oh, 10 and a half. I wonder if the 11s would have fit better. No, the, the length was fine. I'm going to say it was the width. 110. The Flag and Anthem Jamestown short sleeve v neck. That was the red. That was the um, button down. The, the undershirt or one I was wearing under the. No, on top. Oh, the one I wore on top. Yeah. The button up shirt. The button up shirt. Yes. Short sleeve button up. Oh. Yeah. It's $59.50. And that, again, is very equivalent to Kohl's and JCPenney's. 
Um, oh, on Algo, the performance tee, the teal green. I just love this shirt on him. This isn't green. It's teal, which is a blue green. Oh, okay. But they're calling it teal green. It has, <laughs> he's confused y'all, $29. So that's very affordable. Mm -hmm. And the Flag and Anthem Norris Snow Slub Henley, the orange one, $34.50. So his total box is $282.50. Buy all 25% off discount of $70.63 if he kept all five pieces. $211.87. And that includes a really expensive pair of shoes. That isn't bad. That's a really reasonable box. That isn't bad. So I might have to do some digging and see if they have a wide width and... Because I think the four clothing pieces, my opinion, I think he could keep them all. And if the shoes were uh, wide enough, I mean, that's, I liked his box a lot. Of course, Bailey, you like, rock, you're a rock star. I like the quality of all of it. Yes, I do too. I do, I do too. The, 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 the shoes is the only thing that I had an issue with. And that was just because I, I got a big foot. Well, you're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Next Stitch Fix, we are going to pick each other's. So from the preview, now that, now, if we don't like anything, we'll decline it all, and then they'll send another preview. This ought to be good. This ought to be really good. Um, so just- You should be very scared. Yeah. <laughs> just to recap, thank God I've got the style pass. <laughs> just to recap on the giveaway, y'all. First question is Sunday the 2nd, or Monday the 3rd, better. And then the next question was, what is your favorite activity to do? What do you like to do the most on 4th of July? Your favorite foods or food? Your favorite memory of 4th of July? And then what is your favorite part about our channel? And maybe or, and or, what would you like to see? So, we are going to announce the winner on our live. We'll, mm -hmm. we'll do it in real time so you can see who the winner is. You have to be, of course, over 18 and only in the, is it contiguous? I think it's contiguous. Um, continuous. No, contiguous. Contiguous? Contiguous 48 states. The. You know one thing I like about our channel? <laughs> what? Like you. Oh, he has to say that. I'm standing right here. She paid me to say that. Yeah, no, right. <laughs> so I'm really excited about the giveaway. I'm excited about the live. And I'm excited about our next Stitch Fix to see like what he picks and what I pick. And I think I did a pretty good job this time. But... I think you did a real good job. Anyway, please tell us down below. Um, obviously, answer all the questions for the giveaway. But let us know what you think we should keep, if anything at all. Okay. So uh, wow. we're going to go and eat some dinner. So until we meet again, Godspeed and many blessings, y'all. Bye, everybody.